and today we're playing War to Life, a game where we figure out is life worth living? It's an important question I've wondered about for many centuries, and today we'll finally find the answer we've all been looking for all these years. This game looks so cute. I had no idea about it, and then I saw it on the eShop, and I was like, I need it. It looks adorable. Uh, I'll play on normal. You can change appearance at any time. I'm being the cute girl. I want to be her. Oh, uh, your name. Oh, my name is not Ollie. I'm afraid. My my name is Safi. Please do remember it, game. Never call me Ollie again. <laughs> this is okay. Here we go. There's a lot in this game. You can fight monsters. I think you can have like a little farm. You know, there's a lot of exploration. Kind of a town you're building up. It's pretty neat. <laughs> I like the voices for for the king. Oh, you guys can't see him. Hold on, let me poof for a second so you guys can see the king. <laughs> Look at him just rocking back and forth in his chair. It's so funny. His Majesty King Saman the 31st, chosen ones, welcome. I am His Majesty King Saman the 31st, ruler of this kingdom. You all have rather smug looks on your faces, don't you? Very well, very well. It is only those of you who stand before me who have been chosen. Someone chose the guy behind me? Who chose him? <laughs> who chose this guy? Who chose him? <laughs> I need to have a word with the people choosing here. This guy can't even see. These two, well, these two look like they're capable. They have their bow and arrow, but these two guys, I don't know if you should have hired them. Me, on the other hand, perfect candidate. <laughs> the crystals bestowed upon us by goddess Cosmos and said to have kept the peace in our world have lost their light. My fortune teller has foretold that this kingdom will perish if we do not take action. That is why I have called all 30 of you here and will provide you each, and will provide each of you with funds. Take these funds to go on an adventure. Invent something to help others find and sell rare items. In any case, I want you to go out, explore, and find a way to resolve the current crisis. We'll need a name for you. The King's Knights of the Road. How's that? Where are the 30 people? Are they all queued up behind me? Oh, you don't like it? Fine, let's just go with Exploration Corpse then. The monsters are becoming more aggressive and the land is falling into ruin. Your duty is to find a way to fix this. Now then, set out on your journeys. Please wait, your majesty. We must give them the funds. Ah, yes. First, take this 1 million G to support your exploration efforts. Depending on your performance, I will consider providing additional funds. Now then, go set out on your journey. Please wait, your majesty. Mustn't we also mention them? Ah, yes. In order to maintain a report line with the kingdom, you will each be provided with a secretary soldier. They are only for reporting back to me and will not help you in battle. You will have to forge your own path. Now then, this time, really set out your journeys. Alright, boss. Me and all 30 of the rest of us are about to set out. Wait, what's he want? His Majesty is busy. Please submit reports to your secondary soldiers so they can be handled by the appropriate department. Is that all he wanted to say to me? See, there's like a thing above his head. I'm trying to talk to you! Will you won't talk to me! Please! Oh! The day has changed. Please speak to me, man! Oh, that comes up above everyone's head if you're near to them. I thought he had like a quest and I was like, why is he ignoring me? Why is he bullying me? I'm pr I am Prado. I'm an exploration corpse too, but unlike a regular person like you, I'm a member of His Majesty's the King's Elite Guard. Just sit back and watch, for I will be the one to find what His Majesty calls a chance. An amateur like you only <laughs> you need only enjoy their shot at playing adventure. Now calm down. I'm not telling you to return your one million G's. You want to fight? You want to go, soldier? I'll jump on you! I'll jump on you Mario Stomp style! For now, I think I'll leave the Enlore Castle. Christine Safi, my name is Secretary. Great name. 
beautiful name, if I do say so myself. Lovely name. Wish I was called that. <laughs> I will be aiding you in your journey as your secretary soldier. Have you visited the Master Crystal before? You have not. In that case, may I suggest that your first destination be to the Great Temple. The Great Temple is in that direction. You can reach it by heading to the exit on the top of the stone steps. Use the stick to move around. You can jump by pressing the B button. If you push down on the L stick and press the B button at the same time, you can drop down. Please note that this will not be possible in some locations. Press the A button when the cursor appears to talk to someone or investigate something. Finally, press the ZL button to look at the mini-map. It certainly comes in handy when traveling about. Here we go! Sorry, I'm mid-yawn. I'll try not do that again. So you're an exploration corpse too, huh? You sure look reliable. I'm Reed of this kingdom's exploration corpse. Unlike you, I'm one of the few elite who report to the king. I'm off to search for someone the king calls Chance. Don't go getting yourself killed. He is looking for a chance at saving the kingdom. Oh, the steps are cute. I love his art style. Oh, he is like an Animal Crossing voice. He had a murmur, murmur, murmur. Hi, I'm Shuna's exploration corpse. What do you plan to do with your 1 million Gs? I want to use the money to help people in need. So I'm preparing to set out on an adventure. What about you? You're an exploration corpse, right? Over there is the harbor. Are you going to the island? I'm still thinking. Are you really an exploration corpse? You don't seem that reliable if you're going to the Great Temple. Go from here and... He's telling us where to go. Go these stone steps and go straight until you reach the outskirts. Hey! Oh, he's... I guess there are shops around here too. I think they're closed right now though. Oh, these are the shops. Oh. Oh, it changed to daytime. Alright, I won't go over there yet. Wait, well, well, who is in the... Who is in the barrel? Somebody hiding in there. What are you doing? Oh man, I came all the way here from the countryside especially to become a soldier, but they knocked me back. I don't have a job to go to. What am I gonna do? At least he has fashion. Look at that guy on his back. He's carrying the game. <laughs> The monsters around these parts have been getting more violent and causing more of a ruckus. It's keeping most of the peddlers away, so goods from the other cities have become a luxury. What's this? I feel a mysterious power. What is this? Oh, I spoke! I can speak! Who are all these barrel people? Who are they? I like your hair, too. Oh my, thank you for coming. You must be all took it out. Come and let me relieve your fatigue. Are you in the mood for something else? Are you looking to change up your appeal? An appeal is an expression of your own way of life. When you apply an appeal, you'll be able to use powers befitting that particular appeal. There are many different ways to acquire appeal. Trying something new usually yields an appeal. But working hard to master whatever it is will lead to an even more wonderful appeal. It may be tough, but I also expect you'll find it exhilarating. For now, how about giving various things a go and seeing what suits you best? What would you like from me? Change my appeal? Oh, I only have the one for, um... Exploration Corps and increases my HP. This may well be the first step towards a new future for you. Are you on the move for anything else? I think I'm good. I think that's all I need. I'm out of here. Who are you? I heard there are elves living in Porinta. And they're all so beautiful. That's not where we're going, is it? You have a little pet birdie. Oh no, he ran when I came. We have the blessings of the goddess to thank for a lively host, but young people these days never visit the temple. That's where I'm about to go, madam. Yeah, it's nice going with all the exploration corpse junk. Shh, don't let your guard down. You never know who's listening. Sorry, I'll be more careful. But this place is going to be my base for a while. Come on, let's make ourselves at home and continue this inside. Not suspicious at all, huh? <laughs> Who that you are mightier than this rock. If you do not destroy it quickly, it will return to its shape. And how do I... how do I hit the rock? I might need a weapon first. Maybe I get that in a little while. 
Then I'll go beat up the rock. Haha. <laughs> These are the Inlore outskirts. The great temple is just ahead. I forgot to tell you earlier, when you move to a different region as you were doing now, I will make a record for you. If you want to make a record at your own discretion, please press the plus button to open the menu and select save. However, neither you nor I will be able to record your progress unless you are in a safe and peaceful place. Please keep that in mind. Okay, so uh, he won't save me. He's already told me so. I wonder whose vacant lot this is. Oh, wait, can I live there? Oh, can I buy these? I haven't seen you around these parts before. I'm Fanny. What's your name? It's nice to meet you. I'm helping my dad out with the farm. The land around here belongs to the Great Temple, and only the most de dedicated believers can rent land here. That's why our farm is a bit far, far from here, but our house is nearby. Oh. If I'm a dedicated enough believer, I get land. I understand. <laughs> I understand now. Another vacant lot. Can I buy that one? Oh, I can go up here. What's in a tree? What a terrific tree. <laughs> thank you, thank you for the commentary. More vacant lots? Wait, this is pretty cool. There's one up there. Mysterious power crystal. Oh, I needed to keep going that way. I fell down. Oh, there's a lot of vacant lots. Can we buy all this land? Gimme, gimme. I'm excited to see where this game goes. There's quite a bit going on. Birdie! Oh man, not this guy. Again? I don't know who hired you. You, you don't look fit for this job, sir. I am Sherma, a dwarf and member of the Exploration Corps. You're in it too, right? Nice to meet you. I used to be a miner in Inishin. It was there that I discovered the allure of all the beautiful stones you can mine. Now I'm trying to find some as of yet undiscovered stones. If you find any rare stones, please show them to me. Alright, I will do my best. Oh, treasure! In me stone. Whatever that does. What a spectacular stone! I'm enjoying this admiration of stones and trees around us. High class commentary. <laughs> this is the Great Temple. First things first, let's see what the High Priest has to say. What do you gotta say, huh? Santa, is that you? <laughs> Who might you be? A member of the Exploration Corps, you say? I have heard rumors that a promising group was sent out in search of new possibilities in this world. It is deeply troubling that many these days, including the King himself, see no need to place their faith in Goddess Cosmos. You are the only member of the Exploration Corps who has come. It seems everyone has chosen to forget that it is the crystals bestowed upon us by Goddess Cosmos that nourish this land and protect the people from the threat of monsters. It is unthinkable that Goddess Cosmos has forsaken us. That leaves the question of why the crystals have lost their light. Please, if you have not yet decided on how to proceed your journey, could you find out why the crystals lost their light? Oh. You truly will investigate the matter. To begin, I would like you to first investigate the crystals in the temple of each region. Before you depart, I recommend to pray to the goddess Cosmos for safe travels. Stand before the master crystal there and offer up a prayer. I pray to have more hippos. I pray to have more hippos. I pray for more hippos in my life. Please send me more hippos. It's all I need and want. <laughs> Save the people with your hidden power. A hidden strength has awoken inside you. Really? My word, the voice of God is Cosmos. I knew that the crystal had not, complete, not completely lost their power. This presents another mystery. Just who are you? Why would Goddess Cosmos choose to speak with you? Could it be no? But yes, it must be so. Oh, what was the name? It's on the tip of my tongue. Sp -sp -sp spore? Spook? Spork? Spark? Spark. Yes, that was it. The Spark Chive. Could it be that you are a member of the Spark Chive? What is it? 
said to have once inhabited a certain island. According to the stories, they were an impressive people who created and discovered a great number of things. However, the story goes that the island sunk into the sea over a millennium ago. The few surviving members of Spark Tribe married into human households on the mainland. Now all that remains of the Sp Spark, Spark Tribe, why am I getting tongue twisted saying it? Are the descendants of those marriages? Perhaps a few drops of spark type blood flow to your veins. If so, it's possible that the act of praying before the crystal and feeling the presence of Goddess Cosmos awoke that blood within you today. Whatever the case may be, if you follow the message delivered to you and help those in need, I am certain the path forward will open itself. By the by, now that you have received a revelation from Goddess Cosmos that makes you a devout fo follower. I pray once and I'm considered a devout follower. Now I never have to do it again. <laughs> well, I guess I'm going to the other crystals. Would you like to make a donation to the Great Temple? There's something I must add. The land around here belongs to the Great Temple. We do offer a service in which we rent it out to those who donate. Recently, many farmhands have t returned their land and fled to due to the increase in monsters around here. Seeing as you have been blessed with a revelation from the goddess, there is no doubt that a true fortune awaits you. It will surely be much greater than the money you donate today. How about it? Would you make a no donation? Fine. Uh, very good. Such faith is rare among those of your age. I'm sure the goddess will be very pleased. To ensure all donors are treated fairly, Goddess Cosmos takes everything you own. As such, we can only accept a donation of all your financial wealth. What? I got scammed. I got skimmed. You're taking everything I own. I might be a princess, but look, my parents only give me so much allowance, alright? I don't have enough. <laughs> Please offer up all your money. Hold on a sec, no one said anything about my whole life savings. Is that right? Oh, rules are rules. Now come on, your donation if you please. You reluctantly hand over all the money you have. Very good, with that, the big canal stretching from here to the Amor Castle Town is yours to do with as you please. It'd be better for you to know where your land is. Take this with you. Map of Lenmore. You can use the letter button to open the map. Don't forget it. I got scammed my first day here. And they scammed me. How could they? <laughs> Give me my money back, please. What's this? It's a Misty Station. Oh, what's going on? Some Mist talk is talking to me. Can you hear my voice? My name is Misty and I'm still lonely. I want some friends, you see. Uh, I'll be your friend. Truly, oh, I'm so happy. I used to be a part of Free a long time ago, you see. It's not much, but I can actually use some of Free's powers. I can create a path of mist and carry you where you need to go, but you see... But because no one would spend any time with me, I lost my light power. If you give me some light power, then I'll play with you again, you see. I hope you can find a light that suits me just right. I only have one. Will it do anything? This light suits me perfectly, you see. Thank you for the light. I it up, how beautiful, but the in me stone turned into a normal stone. I'm so happy, you see. Uh, oh, so it can warp me. I will, I will wander back myself because I want to see my new land. Which lands are mine? How much of them do I get? <laughs> I'm checking out the stone again. Hmm. Which plots are mine? Can I see these now? I, I can see the misty stations. Can I use this vacant lot for anything, I wonder? Okay, so I... Oh, I own a few vacant lots. Alright, but I need to uh, set something up at them. Can I do anything with them right now? I might have to continue on a little more. Can I do anything else with this tree now? I can still call it terrific. That's pretty cool. I guess we come back here later. And see what we can uh, put on our land. Why did, why did 
there muscles in here? Prove oh that's prove you are mightier than this rock. Alright, I'm heading back. Back to town. Let's see if they will uh, let us go this way now. Sorry, I'm not ready yet. Come back later. Not open yet. That's alright, that's fine. Take your time, guys. This is the harbor. The ferry is the only way to get to Library Land from here. Looking to go to Library Land? If you are, come back once you've got a ferry ticket. I don't have a ferry ticket. Uh, let's see, maybe I should go back to the castle. I need a new task! A new mission! <laughs> I'm hopping away. Oh, does this bring me to another part of town? Oh no, this book brings me into the castle. Oh, who are you? You're so pretty! You wish to speak with me, Ma? You certainly are forward. Consider yourself lucky that I would even dine to speak with you. My name is Well, I trust you already know. You are Safi, I see. Consider it a privilege that I would even inquire back to your name. You have a rather limited vocabulary, I see. You ought to go away and learn how to make proper conversation before you try speaking with me again. Not that I particularly want you to come back. <laughs> How rude! Uh, Alright, I guess not in the castle. And we need a fairy ticket. Hmm... Maybe over here? You wanna go through it and show me your pass? What's a pass? Oh, uh, well, because of the dangerous monsters outside of town, you need one before you can head out. Usually, you'd be able to get a pass in the kingdom, but they've gotten more strict about it on account of the monsters getting more violent recently. So only give them out to the strongest of folks now. If you really want to go through, you're gonna have to journey with someone who already has a pass, or find a way to get your hands on a pass issued by another city. My apologies for warning you earlier that you would need a pass. I wonder if other members of Exploration Corps have devised a solution already. Why don't you try finding one to ask? Oh, he's the only <laughs> This guy, I don't know if I trust him. You over there. You look troubled. I can see what's bothering you. You don't know what to do. You're uneasy, but a little hopeful. Sorry about that. There's no need to be suspicious. I'm a fortune teller. My name is Rouse. Life is like a flowing river. Once you're in the river, it's hard to see what lies ahead. The, a fortune teller like me sits perched on top of a mountain looking down at the river. That's why you can trust me to see where the river is taking you. I see you're an exploration corpse. You might be surprised to know that an old bogey like me is too. Fortune telling really does bring you some good things in life. Now then, let me give you a reading as an exploration corpse friend. Don't worry. Since we're friends, I won't accept any kind of payment. Oh, very interesting. Soon someone will enter your life and afford you the guidance you so deeply need. The river of your life is big and slow moving. You should relax more and let the flow of the river take you with it. Okay, so... Oh? But a pass, of course I have one. I can't go lending it to you, though. More importantly, are you seriously planning on leaving town like that without weapons or armor? You're practically begging to become a monster's dinner. I guess I've got no choice. I'll give you this sword and shield I don't need. I prefer a spear anyway. Thank you! She's so still and daring. Uh, that's a little better. Don't forget, you can swing your sword with the Y button. I hear monsters tonight nice show up in the outskirts and destroy the fields. Might be a good practice for you. Alright guys, I feel like I might need to uh, end off here, but there's something important I need to try first. Some very important business. This rock. Hey. You're an exploration corpse, aren't you? I'm Sue, I'm an exploration corpse too. I'm thinking about heading to another region soon. But before that, I do that, I need to go and pick up my pass. What about you? Do you already have a pass? Uh, do you know how to get one? Yep, luckily my grandfather knows someone high up in the kingdom. He can get one for me. Oh, I know. Want me to ask my grandfather to get one for you too? Yes, please. Because I'm sure it'll be fine. It's a little expensive since it's not easy to get a pass, you know. It'll cost 500,000 Gs. You receive 1 million from the kingdom, right? So 500,000 shouldn't be a problem. Oh, what about the 1 million Gs? Don't tell me you donated it all to the great temple. Man, I just missed my chance. I see, Sari. I guess I won't be able to help you out. No, Peggy, please. I want to see, can I beat up this rock? Swing spark, sweeping attack. 
If you enjoyed it, please leave a like on the video and leave a comment below. Uh, let me know how your day is, how your week is going. Uh, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Uh, and please subscribe too if you would like to see more from me. I would really appreciate it. <laughs>